Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to activate and use the Dray DDNS service. A DDNS or Dynamic DNS service is useful for when your ISP issues you with a dynamic IP address and you need to regularly connect to your network from a remote location. Instead of having to find out what your current IP address is every time, you can instead connect to a domain name which will be automatically updated with your current IP address if or when it changes. The first step is to log into the router and click on product registration at the bottom of the menu. This will take you to the My Vigor login page. After logging in, you'll need to enter a nickname for the first time. We're going to use Demo0302 as an example here. Then click on Add and you'll be presented with a success message. Click OK and it'll take you back to the home page. To activate the DDNS service, click on Trial, then accept the terms and conditions, then click Next. Then click Register and OK to the pop-up. Then back on the router we'll see that the DDNS service is now activated. We have a start date and an expiry date which means it's active. Next we need to create a DDNS profile. Go back to the MyVigor homepage. Then find the device that you just activated from the menu under My Information, My Products. If you have a number of products, it might be quite a long list like this one. Scroll down until you find it in the list, then click on it. Click on Edit DDNS Settings, then enter a domain name. This can be anything you like, as long as it's not the same as someone else has already taken. Then click the Create button. The last thing we need to do is apply the DDNS to our WAN. So we need to log back into the router, then click on Dynamic DNS under Applications in the menu. Click on the box to enable Dynamic DNS Setup, then click OK. Click an index of a profile and check the box to enable Dynamic DNS account. Select Dray DDNS in the Service Provider pull-down menu. Choose the WAN interface, select multiple WANs if DDNS is to apply to more than one WAN, and click OK. Go back to the index, you'll see the domain name has been filled in automatically and should match the name that we entered on the MyVigor page. To check if it's working, enter the domain name followed by .draddns.com into a browser. And voila!